I don't know if you can see these tracks very good or not. It, a couple weeks ago, I took a picture of them trying to figure out what the heck made them. Well, uh, two days ago, somebody told us it's from an alligator. We've seen some earlier right over here. And it had a looked like it was dragging something. And uh, now they're all over in here. They're told me these were made by an alligator, a young alligator. This is one of the areas we like to go fishing at. <laughs> Let's see what's over here. Up oh, there's there's a tail drag, guys. Right there, if you can see it, it's cut in the center of the screen. That was made by an alligator, a young alligator, and that was lines or his tail dragon. He lives around here someplace because we've been seeing quite a few of them. Normally, I'd be standing over water. <laughs> I know. Yeah, he's got this all tracked up in here. Looks like maybe a bigger alligator too. There's a small one again. The deeper ones, they're alligator tracks, but it would have been by a bigger alligator made those. There's some right there. So somewhere in this park, there's at least one if not two alligators living in this area. This is how dry the lake is. Normally you got about four or five foot of water right here. Sort of thing, I think is a, I don't know, one of them herrings. Those tracks right, Let's see where they got, right? Right there, that's it by a heron. But here's the, the alligator tracks. And as you can see, he's dragging the tail. So, anyway, I just thought I'd share that with you. Uh, later, I'll 